some female rappers in Senegal are finding strength in numbers and forming a formidable tribe. Their goal is to lift the veil on gender inequality and push their careers forward. Take a look. From under her veil, Aminata Gay uses her lyrics to promote female empowerment, but in Muslim-majority Senegal, that can be controversial. Some don't think a Muslim woman should rap about forced marriages, rape and female genital mutilation. Amid bruising comments from critics on social media, the guy whose stage name is Minatna Boyli, meaning Mina, the build one, has found strength in numbers by joining an all-female hip-hop collective. It's not easy to be a female rap artist here, so we speak about all that. We speak about all the problems that women face. Mina Lavoy Lee is one of around 70 women that make up the Genja Hip Hop Collective. It was co founded by Ina Tim, who started her career taking photographs of rappers, but today shoots music videos. We're in a country where many things are often a taboo. There are so many things that are not spoken about, which is often the source of problems, especially for women. At first, it was just a WhatsApp group designed to get female rappers and artists to meet and share experiences. Three years later, and it counts DJs, slammers, sound engineers, graffiti artists, and even an urban musical orchestral conductor amongst its members. They've organized the festival and are working on their first album, and they've had a political impact as well. Genji was on the front line of protests last year, opposing violence against women, joining forces with the Dafodoy Collective and lawmakers in a successful campaign to get tougher sentences for convicted rapists.